Hello, Anteater fans. Michael O'Sullivan here with head coach Jeff Perkins going into his first year as the head coach of the outdoor men's and women's track and field team. Uh, Jeff, your seventh year here at UC Irvine, previewing the 2014 season. You take over for legendary head coach Vince O'Boyle, who was here 30 plus years, and we could dedicate an entire episode to what he's done for the program. Now, some of the main things you learned from Vince uh, while here at Irvine. Uh, Vince has taught me a lot of uh, patience, uh, learning how the uh, UC system works, especially specifically here at Irvine, uh, meat management, uh, patience, how to build a team, and uh, really, and in the retrospect of everything, uh, how to be, become a better uh, technical event coach over the years. Now your season kicks off in March this year with the La Jolla uh, All-UC invite, um, and that comes up uh, in mid-March and that's where it really gets everything going. Yeah, the, the ball gets rolling in that quad meet at the beginning of the year. We've right. hosted it perennially the six years I've been here actually and uh, it's finally away down at UC San Diego so um, we're really looking forward to kind of getting away and moving in that direction but it, uh, it's a team championship so it should be exciting and kind of get us off, started off on the right foot. And you get the Anteater four-way meet going right into the spring break invitational right. all here at Anteater Stadium. Uh, that a little bit down the road in March, right. um, but I know those are dates that mean a lot to your team. Yeah, we uh, we have set it up to be uh, Division One school uh, scoring championship type meets, right. um, and so that first meet, the the four way we have here, Purdue is uh, going to be coming through in Long Beach State, and a couple other schools, um, and then the the UC or, sorry the Spring Break Invitational, uh, we're hosting about nine different Division One schools, so we're looking forward to that as well. And then. Uh, Go through April, some more invites. You see Riverside after the spring break invitational. Uh, you mentioned Long Beach. Uh, so we go towards the end of the year now, the Big West Championships. Some of the teams you're expecting to be uh, at the top of the league come the end of the year. Uh, Davis is hosting this year uh, right. up there in Davis, and they are uh, two-time conference champions on the women's side. Um, Long Beach State has had a lot of success there on the men's side. So those really are the favorites at this point in time, uh, you know, preseason right. moving forward. And then looking at your team, uh, you know, as a whole, I know you got big contributions from Ito Sakinbari on, on the women's side, Riley Martin with the men's side, but I know you have a lot of uh, people you're expecting to step up this year. Yeah, we're real excited. Uh, Lacey Surak comes back. She's the defending conference champion in the women's javelin. Uh, Erica Knoll, who's two-time two -time, uh, Big West champion in the 40-meter hurdles. And then uh, right. a lot of players, Mason Miller in the shot put in discus. Um, you can go on and on and on, but a lot of guys and on, guys and girls on the track as well. Young, we have a young team, but a lot of talent in that area that we're looking forward to seeing what they can accomplish this year. Head coach Jeff Perkins talking about the 2014 outdoor men's and women's track and field season. Coach, thanks a lot. Thank you.